is Mr. Chris here, and we're going to be doing a class for you guys so you can follow along, okay? I have my friend Vander here, Miss Kristen's here, Miss Chloe's here, Mr. Subas. So make sure you follow along in class. Here we go. Ready, feet together. Carry up. And kunye. Good. Let's repeat the principles. Knowledge in the mind, honesty in the heart, strength in the body, respect for myself and others. Sir. All right, here we go. So these guys are gonna be doing all the work, but you gotta be moving at home, moving fast, and counting, okay? So let's go ahead and start, guys. Let's count 10 good jumping jacks, counting together. Go! One, sir, good job, sir, keep three, it up. Sir, four, sir, five, sir, six, sir, seven, sir, eight, sir, nine, sir, ten, sir. Awesome, now open those feet a little bit. Make sure your toes are pointing forward. You're gonna bring your hands up. Now your hips go back slightly. You're gonna bend your knees and you're gonna touch the ground. And then you're going to do that again and touch the other hand to the ground. Ready? Ten good squats, counting together. Go. One, sir. Two, sir. Good job. Three, sir. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Good. Everybody Seven, count. Sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. All right. So now we're going to do a little variation of that to build some explosiveness in your legs. What does that mean? That means that you want to be strong, but you also want to be fast. So what we're going to do is we're going to take that same squat and then from here you're going to add a front kick. So you're going to go squat, front kick, squat, front kick. Okay, here we go. Guards up. So we're going to squat and we're going to start with our right leg. Ready? Let's count to ten. Go. One, One sir. sir. Go. Two, Two sir. sir. Good job. Keep it up. Three, Three sir. Four, we're sir. Always kicking to the center Five, line. Sir. Six, Six, sir. Good job. Seven, Seven sir. Eight, Eight sir. sir. Good. Ten, sir. Ten, sir. All right. So the next exercise, you're going to go down into a push-up position. So let's go down into a push-up position. And we're going to go opposite hand to opposite shoulder. Opposite hand to opposite shoulder. We're going to go 20. Ready? You're going to count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, all the way to 20. Go. One, six, two, there you go. Let's count, Black Boss. Six, 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 seven, 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 sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Good job. One, sir. Two, sir. Three, sir. Four, Making sir. sure your body Five, stays six, straight. Six, seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Twenty, sir. Good work. All right, stay right from there. Right from there, you're going to do what's called plank jacks. So you're going to open your feet like you're doing a jumping jack and then bring them back to close and feet together. Ready? Let's make it ten. Go. One, sir. Count together. Four, sir. Good job, guys. Four, sir. Five, sir. Six, sir. Good work. Seven, sir. Eight, sir. Nine, sir. Ten, sir. Good job. Eleven, sir. Good. And then let's go ahead and stand back up. All right, we're going to do a couple stretches here. Ready? So let's start like this, your feet together. We're going to take uh, hands together, take a deep breath up, and you're going to reach all the way back behind you. So reach behind you. You want to try to look at the wall that's behind you. And then you're going to bring it down, breathe out, and keep your legs nice and straight. So legs are straight, or as straight as possible. But your goal should be to start by touching your fingertips to the ground. If you can do that, then you touch your knuckles. And if you can do that, you can touch your palms like Kristen's doing. <laughs> okay, take another deep breath up. Reach up. Look behind you. Get a good stretch on your back. And then bring it back down. Good work. Last time, deep breath up, reach behind you, and then bring it back down all the way, leg straight. So you should feel a nice pull along your hamstring muscle in the back. Excellent. Now let's go back to ready position here. You're going to open your feet. You're going to go twice shoulder width apart. So you're not going to go full middle splits, just twice shoulder width. And you're going to open your hands like this. Just like you're making two hooks, and then you're gonna do just like you were doing a bow, and you're gonna grab your ankles and then pull your head towards the center line. Good work. Now it's not important how far you can go, but that you do this consistently. That's the important part. That's how you get more flexible is by doing this all the time, every day, consistently. Uh, stretching is one of those things that has to become a habit, right? Just like you brush your teeth, just like you take a shower, stretching should be part of your routine. All right, and let's go back to feet together. All right, are you guys ready? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. All right, I like it. Okay, so let's start feet together and attention. Good, and kunye. 
Good, now take this hand, this foot, let's go step right foot back. Let me see, guards are up. Okay, right from here, we're gonna practice throwing that jab. And when you do the jab, make sure you step with your front leg, okay? Just a warm up, ready, go. One, two, yeah. go. Two, yeah. go. Three, yeah. Yeah. make sure you're punching with your top two knuckles and your other hand is up. Ready, go. Three, yeah. four, yeah. five, yeah. six, yeah. seven, yeah. eight, yeah. nine, yeah. and ten. Yeah. Now jump change. Let's do this side now. Keep your guards up, left hand stays up by my eyes. Notice how my knees are bent. And then when I do my jab, I want to step with it. Ready, go. One, yeah. two, yeah. three, yeah. four, yeah. five, yeah. six, yeah. seven, yeah. eight, yeah. nine, yeah. and ten. Yeah. Jump change. Okay, so now we're going to move on to doing our round kick. Now the round kick is one of those kicks that is very basic, but it's very important because you're going to use it all along your journey to, back, to black belt. I'm sorry. So now, guards up here. Okay. You really want to turn your body more sideways. So the more sideways, the better for this round kick. And you're going to take your back toes and you're going to point them away, right? And the reason I do that is so I can lean on my foot for balance. And then from here, all I want to see you guys do is lift up your knee and chamber. So go chamber and then back down. Let's do that five times. Chamber and back down. Make sure your knee's pointing straight ahead. So if you're at home, your knee needs to point towards me. Ready, go three, chamber, back down. Go chamber, back down. Ready, go chamber, and back down. Now, when you do the chamber, the tighter you keep your heel to your hip, the faster and stronger the kick will be. All right, so let's go ahead and do 10 round kicks on this side. Go, one, yeah. Yeah. go two, yeah. yeah. Let's see who's the fastest, let's see. Ready, go three, yeah. yeah. Go four, yeah. yeah. Go five, yeah. yeah. Go six, yeah. yeah. Go seven, yeah. Go eight. Yeah. Good. Jump change. Let's see the other side. So guards are up. Always bending my knees. My back toes will point away. All right. Let's practice just a chamber. Go chamber. Back down. Do it. Make sure it's pointing straight ahead. Go chamber. Back down. Chamber. And you can even grab your foot here and back down to keep it tight. Go chamber. Back down. Last one. Go chamber. Hold it. Back down. All right. Let's make that round kick fast. Ready? Go. One. Yeah. Two. Yeah. Three. Go four. Five. Go six. Seven. And eight. Switch feet. All right, guys, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to put it together now with the jab and the round kick. So we're going to go step and jab. And when I bring it back, I'm going to slide up, round kick. So let's do it slow. Go step and jab. Slide up, chamber, round kick. Step and jab, slide up, round kick. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can do it. Go one, kill. Yeah. Good job. Go two, kill. Yeah. See if you guys at home are keeping up with the black belt. So maybe we're gonna have to slow it down just a little bit. Ready? Go three, kill. Yeah. There you go. Go four, kill. Yeah. Go five, kill. Yeah. Six, kill. Yeah. Good job, guys. Go seven, kill. Yeah. One more. Go eight, kill. Yeah. Yeah. Switch sides. All right, let's see this side. Guards are up, bending your knees. Ready? Let's start slow. So step and jab, slide up, round kick, kick. Go step and jab, slide up, chamber, and round kick, kick. Ready? So this time, we'll go for eight. Now, when you do this kick, it's important. Make sure that you hit with the top of your foot. So your toes have to be pointed, right? I point my toes, just like Bander was doing there, right? I'm pointing my toes, so I'm hitting with the top of the foot and not my toes. Ready, guards up. Jab and round kick. Go, one, yeah. go, two, yeah. three, yeah. good job guys. Go, four, yeah. and always, always, always eyes where you're kicking. Eyes where you're kicking and punching. Go, five, yeah. go, six, yeah. go, seven, yeah. and eight. Yeah. Good job, back to feet together. Good job, take a deep breath. Reach up, reach up, reach up. Look behind you. And go back down to stretching. There you go. Good, again, take a deep breath up. And reach back down. All right, now from here, let's do a couple of uh, spine twists. So you're gonna take your two hands, keep your feet pointed forward, do not twist your feet. You're gonna turn and look behind you. Let's go for 10, go. One, two. Three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, and ten. All right, last technique we're gonna teach you in this video is the back leg round kick. So the back leg round kick, I'm gonna go back to my ready position. So we're all here. And the first thing that you gotta do is you have to make sure that you turn your front foot, your front foot, your toes on your front foot, right? So I turn my toes, okay? From here, I'm gonna rotate my hands and notice how my body's already from facing this way, it's gonna be facing the opposite direction. I'm gonna bring my back knee up, I chamber, I'm gonna kick, re-chamber, and then set it right in front of me. And then I'm gonna step back. Here we go, ready? So turn your toes, turn your hands, chamber and kick, kick. Set it down in the front and then step back. All right, here we go, a little bit faster. Turn those toes, turn your hands, right? Chamber, notice how my body's pointing the opposite way, round kick, boom, and then step back. All right, here we go, we're gonna do eight each side. Ready, go, one, kick, and then step back. Two, kick, and then step back. Now that kick can go anywhere on the center line. It could go to the body, could go to the head, okay? For right now, these guys are doing head level, but you guys at home may do body level. Ready? Go, three, go, kill, and then step back. Go, four, kill, good. Always hands up, always eyes forward, and always kill. Go, five, kill, good. Go, six, kill, good. Go, seven, kill. And go eight. Kill. Good. And then step back. Then switch feet. Let's try the other side. Guards up. Now notice this is kick is called a round kick. So it goes around the target and strikes. Yes? So guards are up, bending my knees, turn those toes. Ready? Go. One. Kill. And then step back. Go. Two. Kill. Good. And then step back. Always set it in the front, then step back. Rather than trying to pull that kick all the way back, because you're gonna stop your momentum. Go. Three. Kill. Good. Go four, kill. Go five, kill. Three more. Go six, kill. Good job. Go seven, kill. Good, I'm watching you guys at home. Go eight, kill. Good, and then step back. Awesome job. Okay, shake your hands out, shake your legs out. All right, excellent job, guys. If you want more practice, make sure you go through the video again and really make sure that you're paying attention to the technique. Yes, sir? Let's go ahead and feet together, turn you up. And kunye. Always say thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Alright, till next time.